guys. I did it. I found how to make Suchiken sauce. I did it. Let me show you how. The first step is you need a 500 milliliter mason jar. Then, our next step is we're going to add the Kikakuman soy sauce. You'll need six tablespoons. After you put in the soy sauce, you want to put in six tablespoons of the lime juice. The next step is to put six tablespoons of 100% pure olive oil into the mixture. Now you should have this weird looking, the oil on top and then the soy sauce and the lime juice on the bottom. Then you're gonna, gonna wanna put three tablespoons of sriracha in next. All right guys, so then after this, after the three tablespoons of this, you wanna have six tablespoons of the brown sugar. I'll show you what it looks like. Alrighty, so after you put in the brown sugar, you should have something like this. What you wanna do is you wanna stir. Now if you already think it's shaken enough, make sure you shake it again. That's where we put it in a mason jar. Most great chefs, we have to make our thing cool. Hey guys, I just got out of class. Well, I'm gonna grab the nuggets and then we'll show dad. A moment. Alrighty. Sorry about that, order whenever you're ready. It's all good. Can I get 120 chicken nugget? 120 count chicken nugget? And that's all. Any sauce? Uh, no, cause uh, I think I actually made the Sech Chan sauce. Alright. Yeah, man. It's pretty dope. I didn't tell you what this is. But this is Sech Chan sauce. Sech Chan? Yeah. What the hell is that? You know what it is. It was in 1998 when they pro were promoting the film Mulan. Szechuan, maybe? Yeah, Szechuan. No wonder why the guy liked me at McDonald's. Is it spicy? Yes. It's why would I want to eat it? Because you like spicy. It's not that spicy. Thoughts? No, it's fine. Do you love it? I love it. 